Hi, my name is Mark Tamaris. I'm a photographer based in Porto, Portugal, and my focus is on wine. Commercial photography as well as uh, fine art photography. Wine is my inspiration and uh, what I do most of the time here in my studio. Uh, I'm really excited today because I received something from Josefine Hutte, pardon the maybe not perfect pronunciation, a wonderful handmade glass company. Uh, and this box came in from München in Germany just the other day. So this is going to be an unboxing video and my first impression of these wonderful glasses uh, designed by an Austrian um, glass blower called Kurt Josef, excuse me, Kurt Josef Zalto. Uh, why did I buy these glasses? I do commercial photography and the wine glass is one of the most visible things on my sets for my wine clients. So I want things that are unique, beautiful, high quality, and just exude quality and uh, creativity. I've also been working on some fine art projects with wine photography, and to have a boring glass is horrible. To have something exquisite and beautiful, this is what I'm after. So let me see what we have in this box. Oh, fantastic. So I bought the kit that they have available on their website, like a starter kit, and I believe that's what this is. And I also ordered uh, two of the universal glasses, which are kind of used for all types of wine, um, in addition to the starter kit. So this is fun. I feel like it's my birthday. Which we start with? Let's start with. Let's start with the universals. Wow, they did a great job with the packaging. I guess you would have to if you're if you're sending uh, fine, delicate glassware and you package it badly, it's probably not going to go too well. So these are the universal glasses. Oh wow. These are Awesome. <laughs> These are really nice. Go away. Wow, look at that. They have a little bit of the logo right here in the bottom and normally you just see like the etching of a name of a company but this is a really beautiful logo as well. They have this great unique curvy shape to them. That's beautiful glass. So this is the universal glass. Super cool. And let's see what else they sent me. So this is the polishing kit. Let's take a look and see what that looks like. This glass care kit is fantastic because making sure the, the wine glasses um, look perfect is, well, it's important to me. If I sit down with a fine wine, I think it's really wonderful to have a perfect looking glass. I don't want to see spots and streaks or water droplets. Um, and I was just looking at this glass care card and they give you some nice instructions on how to uh, use everything properly and um, how to polish them. And then this little, it's a uh, natural hair brush for getting little last droplets of water um, off of the glass. So. Um, at home, this is going to be great. In the studio, it's fantastic because when you're taking a photograph of a wine and you see a little dot or like a piece of wine, a little driplet of wine splashed or something like that, it's not usable. It has to look really, really clean and perfect. So I'm definitely going to make use of the cleaning kit. All right, let's check out the, the champagne. Josephine number four.
Oh, wow. You know, I ordered these for my studio for my photography, but I'm really feeling the, um, the need to bring these home as well. <laughs> these are fantastic. So that was, this is number four, the Champagne. And this is the Universal. Now we have the white. Gorgeous. They're really pretty. This little, um, bumpy curve here. I'm not exactly sure how to describe it. Uh, it looked fantastic when I saw them on the website. It looks so much better in person. Well, I think I made the right choice because I wanted something, like I said, that was extremely well done, creatively designed, and beautiful. And I think that this fits the bill. All right, so this is Josephine number three, the red. Oh wow. Fantastic. So wide, <laughs> this is really cool. It's perfect. So the red, the white. Oh, actually, no, that's the universal. So the red, the universal, the white, and the champagne. Quite a set. I cannot wait to put a camera on these. Um, well, that concludes my unboxing experience. I still have a few more glasses in the boxes, but they are well, really well packed. They're they're absolutely gorgeous. I can't wait to try them out uh, in the kitchen with a fine wine and also here in the studio. So thanks for watching my unboxing and you will see soon some photography made with these wonderful glasses. Talk to you later.